take a look at the course links in the description box below to see our full Garrett Code Review online training course. Welcome to an introduction to Garrett. In this lecture, we will cover what is Garrett, why use Garrett, what is a code review, and some basic Garrett terminology. Garrett is a source code management platform, just like GitHub, Bitbucket, or Team Foundation Server. Just like any source code management platform, it can manage multiple repositories and Git resources for multiple projects or teams. Garrett's version control system is Git. Garrett provides an optional code review workflow that stores changes before they are committed to the repository. And it provides access control for Garrett projects and repositories. Garrett is free, open source, and it is used by Google to develop the Android operating system. Garrett's code review workflow is lightweight and captures the team discussion on code changes through change reviews. This information is persistent and auditable. Garrett allows the flexibility to control team workflows through access controls and ensure all code changes go through stringent quality assurance checks. Access controls manage the Git repository references and the Garrett web-based interface. Developers do not need additional tools to interact with Garrett. They just need their local Git client and a browser. A code review is a process of quality assurance that involves others reading and checking source code to offer suggestions, recommendations, or approvals. Performing a code review involves two main stages. The first is submitting code changes to Garrett. Garrett keeps these change commits in a staging area. This is where the second stage happens and the change is reviewed. It can be reviewed by peers or team members, it can also be verified or tested by continuous integration tools. Once a change is approved, the code is merged into the repository. In a code review, team members can comment, approve, reject, push additional code patches, see a diff between versions, see dependencies, and see the change status. Here is some Garrett terminology that may come up. A change represents a single commit that is under review. Changes are identified with change IDs. Patch sets are subsequent commits attempting to amend an existing change. 